Oh, baby, what's this? Michigan and what? Michigan and what? Ace? I'm finna park this mother on 62nd in Michigan. Somebody come get my stupid. Please come get me. Please come get me. Please go get me. I'm on 62nd in Michigan. I just parked this. Go. Please come get me. Not long after getting tased, shots can be heard going off in the background from the police. The live stream continued after he was hit, with more than 6,000 people still watching. The video also captures police comments after Sean had been hit, because one officer can be heard saying, I think it's gonna be a closed casket, homie. Probably, probably right after here. him and then tased him. And then I'm saying that's a good thing to shoot at him. That's yeah. One of the detectives eventually notices the phone and ends the live. But the video quickly started going viral on social media, leading to accusations of police brutality. Police claimed that Sean fired first and they were just protecting themselves. But the comments definitely weren't a good look. The officer who did it was put under investigation. And Sean's mother ended up winning a wrongful death lawsuit for $390,000 in February 2023. But now, let's talk about GBO Gaston, because he's a LA rapper known for dissing people for clout. After Nipsey passed, he started claiming that it was his body. Gaston originally came up as a gaming YouTuber, but he started going crazy on social media, chasing clout and trying to act hard. He threatened dudes like Crip Mac on IG Live before. And there's even one video that surfaced that shows him blowing at one of his ops while they were on IG Live with each other. Where's Ty Dammy? He's trying to hear him. The dude wasn't phased by what GBO Gaston did, since he knew Gaston wasn't really about that action. This clip went insanely viral, since no one had ever seen anything like that before on live. But the video only gets crazier, because Gaston isn't the only rapper who got famous from crazy incidents that happened on live. Because Honeycomb Brazy has had multiple incidents on live that could have costed his life. Because in November 2020, Alabama rapper Honeycomb Brazy went to buy a Kobe Bryant jersey from someone in Montgomery, Alabama. And Brazy was chilling in a parked car outside a barbershop with some of his partners showing off the jersey to everyone on his live. 